Hi, Jenny. Hi. ¿Cómo le va? I'm good. Excellent. Very good. Me va a regalar Okay. Thank you.
Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Con ánimo, con ánimo. Está bueno. Ah. Me da la fuerza. Good evening. Good evening, Chiqui. Hijo, recogerme. Hi, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Fine, thanks. And you? I'm very happy to see you, Mari. Thank you. Me dejaron solita, Mari, Laurita, Michelle. Pero ya están aquí, eso es lo importante. Eso, estamos ya para ponerle sabor aquí. I'm so sorry. <ríe> aquí estamos. Excelente. Pero vi la clase, o sea que te, okay. tengo este día cuatro horas de clase. Ah, ok, perfect. Very good. <ríe> very, very good. All right. So, Roxana, welcome. Jenny, ya la habíamos saludado. Chiqui, hello. Y Charlie. Hi, Charlie. How are you? Hello. Hello, Miss. Good night. Good evening. How are you? Very good. Excellent. Todo bien en sus días? Sí? Yes. Sí. Excellent. Very good. That's very, very nice. Okay, a ver. Eh, bueno, por mi casa está casi que llueve y no llueve. A ver cómo nos va. Esperemos que todo salga bien. All right. No, no sé si está lloviendo por la casa de ustedes. ¿Quiere llover sí. o todavía? No está lloviendo aún. Ya, ya, sí, está, ya, ya está lloviendo. Sí, ¿verdad? Ya, está ya empezó, ya inició este ya relajo. Inició. <risa> sí, yo sé. Bueno, esperemos que pues la Inter nos deje trabajar en paz y a gusto, ¿verdad? Para que tengamos una buena clase. Very good girls and Charlie. Charlie, hasta ahorita usted es el único caballero que nos acompaña. Excelente. <risa> <laughs> All right, very good. Ah, Diana, también ya entró. Qué bueno que esté aquí con nosotros. Y Jasmine, Edith, Lorena, igual. Wow, very good. Excellent. Okay, so yesterday, guys, we finished unit two, section two. So today we're going to begin section three or unit three. All right, so that's what we're going to begin with. Me que teníamos, eh, dejamos en jabón un ejercicio, ¿verdad que sí, Roxy? Si me ayuda, Chiqui y Jenny, con el ejercicio que teníamos pendiente. Tuvimos dos ayer, ya casi al final de sí. clase. All right. A ver, solo déjenme sí. y se los comparto. Y al final, pues, el tiempo y a la hora, okay. conforme a la el de corrección de los errores lo terminamos, ¿verdad? Yo siempre les he contado que cuando... Yes, parte sí. Excelente. Ok, so, de repaso nos va a servir la siguiente, el, el siguiente ejercicio que teníamos. All right, so I'm going to share that with you. Lo vamos a hacer acá, ahorita, juntos y juntas, para que no vayamos ahorita a ningún grupo y ya después con el nuevo tema tendremos suficiente tiempo para hacer. All right, entonces, les voy a asignar, a ver, ahorita vemos 10, y mi persona obviamente, pero yo no cuento. All right, tenemos 10 ahorita y son 16 eh, dificultades, digamos, right, pero no son difíciles, son, son fáciles. All right, entonces, voy a asignar una cada una, no quiere decir que las demás no las vamos a hacer, pero en la que le asignen esa, preocúpese más, ok, a ver. Laurita, para darle la bienvenida, porque ayer me dejó solita, Laurita, mentira. Eh, usted va a ser la primera. Mari, you're doing number two. 
Uh, de verdad que no es por, por maldad, ¿verdad? Pero así están en mi pantalla. Okay. So, Laurita, number one. Mari, number two. Chiqui, please do number three. Roxy, please do number four. Apunte el número porque a mí se me va a olvidar luego. Jenny, you're number five. Charlie, you're number six. Diana, you're number seven. Edith Lorena, you're number eight. Si gusta, vayan viéndola ahí, tome la foto. Porque voy a moviendo. Jasmine, you're number nine, Jasmine. All right. Si tiene la foto de ayer, es la misma, ¿verdad? De hecho, está en el grupo. Adilio, que acaba de entrar. Hi, Adilio, number 10. Usted trabaja en la número 10, Adilio, en todas. Pero la 10, preocúpese más, ¿ok? De esto depende su curso. No, mentira, Adilio. All right. María, <risa> María José, number 11. <risa> María José, number 11. Jasmine, Jasmine ya le había asignado. A ver, number 12, Marisol. Ok. Y Eden no ha entrado, Jas. Ahorita, voy. <ríe> Ahorita va. Ah, vaya, dígale que él está a cargo de la 13, dígale ahí. Right. Vale, la 13. 13. Ok, very good. Y luego, pues no tenemos todavía a nadie más entrado, entonces nos repetimos. Quiere decir. Good evening. Eh, hello, Ede. Quiere decir que Laurita, usted va otra vez con la 14, Mari con la 15 y Chiqui con la 16. All right. Ok, okay guys. Okay. Yep. Ok, entonces las dejo aquí en pantalla. Trabajenlas. Trabaje ahorita, esfuércese un poquito más en la suya, pero si puede adelantar con las demás, genial. Eh, son las 8 y 6, según mi reloj, les voy a dar 3 minutitos. All right. A las 8 y 9, 8 y 10, empezamos a revisar. Ok, trabaje usted ahí, concentradita. Yo me callo, ya entro Damari y Frank. Laurita, ¿sabe qué? Me va a regalar la 14, Ay, se la voy a dar a Damari. Y a Frank le voy a dar la 15 a usted. Maribel, desentiéndase de la 15. Solo Chiqui sigue con la 16. Ok. Thank you. Miss. Hello. Yo tengo las... dos. ¿Quién yo? Chiqui. ¿Dónde está mi? Eh, las indicas. Yo tengo 3 y 16. Ahora ya no tengo la 3. ¿Cómo no, Chiqui? Chiqui estaba hablando, ¿verdad? Ah, ok. Both. Yes, yes, yes. Both, es, es que no ha entrado más nadie todavía, Chiqui, por eso se repite usted. <laughs> All okay. right. Okay. Don't worry, don't worry. Which one? Which one? Hola, hola. Eh, Damari, yours is 14. And Frank, yours is okay. 15. Marisol, your, 15, yes. Marisol, la suya es la 12, creo, ya. Yeah. Sí, lo único que como acabo de entrar, Ok, la indicación es, ¿se acuerda que eso es lo que estuvimos viendo ayer? No sé si usted estuvo, en, logró estar en toda la clase, Mari, pero ahorita solo lea la número 12 que está en pantalla, resuélvala ahí, mm -hmm. escoja la mejor opción y luego la revisamos. Mari, esa es la opción ahorita, ¿ok? Ok. Thank you. Ya me callo, ok, concentre. <risa>
All right, guys, it's um, 8.10 already, so we're checking, all right? Very good. Okay, let's see. ¿Necesitan más tiempo o estamos ya bien para empezar? I'm ready. Excellent, I'm ready very good, too. excellent. I like that, very good. Okay, I'm Laura. Ready. Very good. Ready. Excellent. Perfect. Very good. Laurita, aha, uh -huh. number one. Yo se la leo y usted me dice cuál es la opción. My brother, his favorite TV oh. program every evening. Aha, uh -huh, Laurita. Watches. Watches. Very good. My brother watches his favorite TV program every evening. Very good, um, Laurita. Excellent. Number two, Mari. I live in a small apartment near the college. Excellent, Maribel. Very good, Mari. Yes, in the college. Yes. All right, like university. I live in a small apartment near the college. Excellent. Very nice. Number three, Chiki, can you please do it? She speaks three languages, English, French, and Spanish. Excellent. She speaks three languages. Very good. Thank you so much. Let's see, number four. Who is doing number four, guys? Me. Okay. Roxana. Yes, Roxy, thank you. Uh, for my friend has a sister, but he doesn't have a brother. Excellent, Roxana. Have very good, yes. Very nice, Roxana. Excellent, very nice. I number five. Who's doing number five? Me. Okay. Is your father a teacher? Okay. Is your father a teacher or a policeman? Excellent. Is your father a teacher or a policeman? Very nice. What about number six? Who's doing number six? Me. Okay, Charlie. Yes. Where uh, my wife and I are from Canada. Where do you where do you where do you from? Mm, Charlie, seguro Charlie. Como que se llama Charlie. Charlie, Charlie. Ya me puedo sudar. ¿Dónde está el verbo en esa pregunta? En la parte de abajo. Está haciendo ahorita. My wife and I are from Canada. ¿Dónde está el verbo en you from? Verbo oh, de acción. Yes, yes. Where, where yes, Charlie. Where are you from? ¿Verdad? Very good. Ahí no hay verbo de acción. Where are you from? Excellent, Charlie. Thank you very much. Very good. Number seven, who's doing number seven? Me. Okay. Uh, my sister's name 
is Susan. She is a doctor. My Susan. sister's name is Susan. She is perfect. Very good. Thank you very much. Nice. All right. Number eight. Who's doing number eight? Me. Okay. I live in Rio de Janeiro. Mm -hmm. Where do you live? Excellent. Where do you live? Live is verbo de acción. Excelente. Very nice. Thank you. Number nine, I think it was Jasmine. I'm not sure. Yes. Okay. I am not. I am not a very, a very boost, busy. Boosting, B busy, Jas. Busy. busy person. Busy person. In fact, in fact, I have lost. Lost. No, lots of three of of three time. Okay. Otra vez. <laughs> <laughs> Vuelva a decir toda, Charles, para que la practique. A ver, ajá. <laughs> espérame, 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 que la perdí. Aquí está. I am not a very busy person. In fact, I have lots of three of time. Excellent. Very good. Jasmine, very nice. I am not a very busy person. In fact, in fact, quiere decir de hecho. In fact, I have lots of free time. Very nice. Thank you, Jas. Number 10. Who's doing number 10? Me. Yes. All right. Adilio. We, we like swing, go joy, and play sport. To stay strong and healthy, algo así. And healthy, yes, yes, very good, Adilio, very nice. We like to swim. Sería la B. We like to swim, jog, and play sports. Yes, it's letter B. Very good, nice. Thank you, Adilio. Number 11, who's doing 11? Maria Jose. No. Yes. All right, very good, Maria Jose. Mm -hmm. Right. I usually get up very early in the morning. Maria Jose, I usually get up or I usually get up, Maria Jose? Get, yeah. Yes, very good. I usually get up. Very good, letter A, nice. Number 12, uh, Marisol. My classmate. It's not class. Right now, she's in the library. No, in the library. <laughs> come on, come on. Very good. Very good, Marisol. My <laughs> classmate isn't, isn't in class right now. She is in the library. Acuérdense she's que the library is in the Very nice. Thank you. Very good, Marisol. Okay. 13. Um, creo que era Ede. Yes. 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 I work. Se me movió. Ahí That's está. <laughs> I, I work 12 hours a day, but I love my job. Excellent. Ede, very nice. Thank you. 14. I think it was the Mari. Miss. Yes. Dice Michelle que, que se le fue el internet. Okay. All right. Okay. Pero ya me volvió, Miss. Ah. All right. Michelle. Ok. La número 14. My friends aren't busy because they are on holiday. Excellent, Damari. Very good. My friends aren't busy because they are on holiday. Very nice. 15, Frank. Mm. Uh, what do I do usually go on holiday? Yes, what do you usually, uh, what, uh, you said what? Mm. Mm. Where? Where, very good. Where do you Where, usually yes. go on holiday? Okay, where do you usually go on holiday? I usually go to Greece, very nice. And 16, um, 
Chiqui, pero ¿sabe qué, Chiqui? Se la vamos a regalar a Bea, porque Bea entró. Con gusto. Excelente, Bea. <risa> Bellita, si nos ayuda con la 16, please. 16. Yes. Ah, uh, okay. Ok. Uh, ¿Dónde estoy? Uh, my mother. My mother teaches English at, at a high school. Excellent, uh, Bea. Yes, at a high school. Very at good, a high Bea. school. <laughs> very good, Bea. My mother teaches English at a high school. Excellent. Very good, guys. Thank you. All right, super. Mire que si esto hubiera sido el examen, todos salen super bien. All right, so very, very good, guys. Thank you for that. Congratulations. Okay. Ese va a ser, nos sirvió de repaso eh, para cerrar la unidad 1 y 2, ¿ok? Y ahorita voy a continuar con la asistencia y luego ya damos inicio a la unidad 3. All right, so we have Adilio Hernández Polanco. Present, Miss. All right, um, Sonia Daisy Hernández de Guardado. Arely del Carmen Cortés de Peña. Present. Gloria Dayana Álvarez de Morales. Present. Roxana Elizabeth Alcántara de Roldán. Present. Carlos Mauricio Cabrera Moreno. Present. Yolanda Beatriz Angulo de Bielman. Present. Thank you. Paola Giselle Guardado Ortega. Ada Carolina Campos Viuda de Ruano. Marisol Chinchilla de Rivera. Present. Edith Lorena Martínez de Sandoval. Present. María José Alfaro de Hernández. Present. Yasmín Yamilet Pacheco de Meléndez. Present. Edgar Edenilson Meléndez Rivera. Present. Laura Noemí Rivas Rivas. Present. Thank you. Katherine Michelle Mejía Hernández. Present. Jenny Marisol Escobar Hernández. Present. Ercilia Damari Quinteros Alvarado. Present. Gloria Maribel Mazariego de Morales. Present. Francisco Antonio Renderos. Present. Excellent. Very good. Ok, tenemos 17. Nos faltan tres compañeras. Pau me acaba de escribir. Parece que va a tratar de unirse más tardecito, which is very good. All right. Ok, very good. Ok, guys. So, as I said, uh, we're going to begin unit three or section three of your um, course. Entonces, quiere decir, o en otras palabras, es que estamos a medio curso. All right, ya llevamos 10 días, este es el día 11. All right, acuérdense que son 20, lo han hecho súper bien. Yo quiero felicitarles de verdad porque yo sé que es bien difícil después de un día de trabajo eh, venir a ser estudiantes ahora, ¿verdad? Entonces, sí se les admira mucho, se les felicita y se les anima a que sigan súper bien así como han ido hasta hoy. Los felicito por la plataforma, ¿verdad? A las 4 de la tarde solo me hacían falta tres compañeritos que terminaran el examen de medio curso. Espero que ya lo hayan logrado terminar, ¿verdad? Para que no se les acumule, ¿verdad? Hoy vamos a iniciar la tarea 11. Esta semana solo son tareas diarias. Es hasta el final de la semana 4 de la unidad 4 que volvemos a tener el, el examen final, ¿verdad? Entonces, siempre animarles a que no vayan dejando sus tareas para después, para que no sientan muy pesado, ¿ok? Uh, very good. No sé si tienen alguna pregunta, alguna duda hasta ahorita de lo que se ha visto. Seguimos siempre con el presente simple, pero le vamos a ir agregando un poquito más para ir como, como avanzando, ¿verdad? Yes, vea, dígame. Yo tengo una consulta con respecto a la plataforma. Cuando el chequecito está en verde, es porque sí se envió la tarea, ¿verdad? 
Sí, sí, vea. Ah, ok. Es que en el examen no me aparece nada. No, 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 no tiene que aparecerme un chequecito. No. Pero fíjense, vea que yo revisé, como le digo, a las 4 de la tarde y ya vi su nota, su progreso, ya estaba bien. Ah, ah, vaya, vaya, vaya. Estamos Está bien. Sí, es que lo hice en el teléfono porque ah. no. No tenía, no me funcionaba el internet, entonces lo hice en el teléfono, entonces no sé si, se, si lo logré. Gracias, sí, gracias. Yo igual, eh, ayer lo hice, ayer lo hice después de la clase, pero eh, no sé, me salió quizás error y ahora lo hice en la tarde otra vez. Ok, sí, Frank, fíjese que de hecho solo me faltaba Adilio y me faltaba Edith Lorena y Michelle, nada más para que me el examen de medio curso. Los demás estamos súper bien. Ok. okay. All right, ya. Yeah. Entonces estamos bien, eh, Bea. Pero igual siempre no, no está de más que me pregunten, ¿verdad? Pero cualquier cosa yo le estaría escribiendo así de, mmm, ¿qué pasó, Beita? <risa> ¿Verdad? Pero si no, es que estamos bien. Excelente, Adilio. Yo sabía, yo sabía. Very good. Thank you. <risa> Very good. Ok, gracias Bea por su pregunta. No sé si alguien más tiene alguna duda o consulta, ya sea al respecto de la plataforma o de lo que se ha visto hasta ahorita. ¿Estamos bien entonces? Hola. Yes, teacher. Yes, me. Todo bien. All right, very good. Okay, so vámonos al manual, please. Let's go to your book now. And we're going to start on page 29, okay? Now, Ede, hágame el favor, Ede, donde dice, I will be able to. Please read this. Describe the different departments in your workplace and what they do. Okay, very good. Describe the different departments in your workplace and what they do. Very good. Uh, let me see, Maria Jose. All right, can you read number one, Maria Jose? Esto que está aquí arriba. Brainstorm about the different departments in your workplace. Where do you belong to? What do you? What do you do? All right, very good. Thank you, Maria Jose. Very good. Okay. Se acuérdense que este es inglés para el trabajo y es donde vemos como mucho eh, vocabulario, como un poco más técnico, ¿verdad? Donde hablamos de diferentes departamentos dentro de un trabajo, dentro de una oficina. Ahora, la mayoría de ustedes, bueno, todos ustedes trabajan en un colegio. All right, entonces no tenemos production area, no tenemos purchasing, no tenemos eh, qué sé yo. All right, de diferente forma, siempre hay diferentes áreas. All right, but most of us were teaching. All right, but that's okay. La idea acá es como también aprender un poquito eh, de otro tipo de vocabulario, no solo apegado a lo que en este caso es nuestro rubro, que sería educación. All right, so number one, we have production. Number two, we have research and development. Number three, we have purchasing. Number four, we have marketing. Number five, human resources management. And number six, accounting and finance. Okay, so we have six departments here. All right, now, antes de seguir, all right, quiero que, pi que piensen en el colegio, all right, in your school. Which departments do you have in the school? All right, can you think and tell me the departments that you find in the school? Administration. Administration, yes, very good. What else? Maintenance. Maintenance, very good. Yes, of course, very good. Two departments, A any other? Uh, how do you say facturación? Yeah, pues, mm, like billing, 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 right. billing yes, B-I-L-L-I-N-G, billing, uh -huh. what else, very good. Mm, 
for attention al cliente podría yeah. ser también. All right, like, yeah. Um, Reception. Yeah, like, like receptionist, yeah. customer ah, service, reception eso, area. Yeah, okay. <laughs> All right, very good. All right. Very good. Okay, so you see. Contabilidad. Yes, accounting. Very good. Yes, we have accounting and billing, right? The financial of the institution. Very good. Maintenance. We have a customer service. We have the reception area, which is customer service in a way. We have administration. Todo lo que pasa en administración. All right. Very good. So we have different departments in the school. Ahora. I want you to think about this. Which department do you belong to? A ver, se los pongo aquí en la pizarra y quiero que lo piensen ustedes. All right, I'm just going to write it here. Which department do you work in? Uh -huh. Which department do you work in? Do you work in the reception area, in billing or accounting, maintenance, administration? Which is your area? Which one is your department? Maybe classroom, no. Um, because you're a teacher. I don't know if you have, do you have a specific name for that area? Like for the teaching department, I guess it would be the teaching department. But I don't know if you have a specific name for that in the school. Is there, Chiki, do you know, Mari, is there a, a, a specific name that you give in the school to that department? Maybe a Spanish area and... Oh, the English area. Inside. Yeah, in the, in, yeah, English area and Spanish area inside the teaching, teaching, mm -hmm. teaching department, did yeah. you say? Yeah, that's what I said, yeah. Okay. All right, very good. That, that's good. You know what? If you are, okay, if you're a teacher, digamos que you belong to the teaching department. Pero dentro de la teaching department, porque su colegio es bilingual, you can say the Spanish area or the English area. All right, so or you, you know what? Specific. We uh -huh. have... We have uh, uh, small areas like elementary uh -huh. teacher, school, um, high school teacher, preschool teacher, kindergarten okay. teacher. All right. So you can like you can specific in which area or department you belong to. All right. So that's very good. Thank you, Chiki, for that info. All right. Piense ahí y luego empezamos a compartir y me van diciendo. All right. Very good. All right, Miss Bea, voy a dejar de compartir aquí. Ajá, Bea, what, in which department do you work in? Wh which department do you belong to? I belong to pre, uh, preschool the first. Preschool department, let's say, and the English area uh -huh. or Spanish area, Miss Bea? English area. Excellent, very good, thank you, very nice. Okay. Me escucha, me escucha, yo, es que está lloviendo horrible. <laughs> Aquí también. Lo oigo cortado. All right. Okay. Oh, gracias. Pero sí le escucho, Beita, no se preocupe. A ver, Diana, which department do you work in, Diana? Uh, teaching department, uh, kindergarten and system, and okay. no sé cómo se dice nursery. Nursery? Nursery. Yes, nursery. Uh. Very good. Nice. Okay, Diana, <laughs> very nice. Very good. Let's see. What about Adilio? Aha, uh -huh, Adilio. ¿Y por qué pasa por aquí y pasa por otro lado? Formulando <laughs> la estaba. Ah, vaya, le doy más tiempo, no se preocupe, ya regreso, tranquilo. Thank you, All thank, right. you thank you. <laughs> Very good, let's see. Um, Ede, what about you, Ede? Uh, 
I I I work in a Spanish area. Okay. In, from six uh, to eleventh grade. Okay. All right. So you are in junior and high school, junior high and high school? Yes. All right. Yes. Okay. Very good. Interesting. Thank you. Very good. Uh, what about Mari? Aha, uh -huh, Mari. Can you tell us about yourself? Which department? Which area? I work in. Um coordination area. area very good yes Mari. very good coordination area ah, all right with very the nice. elementary teacher of basic oh teacher. very nice okay nice very good okay i get it very nice thank you what about chiki tell us about you chiki Okay, I belong to teaching department. I'm sorry, but the rainy is loud. I know, that's okay. Uh, I belong to teaching department in a kindergarten area as um English teacher. Okay. Can be can be formulate like that? Yes, perfect. It's perfect, Chiki. Yes, thank you. Okay. Excellent. Very good. Okay. okay. What about what about of uh, the money. I belong to the Spanish area. Area? Area? A area, yes, area. Very with, good. Yeah, area with kindergarten. Very nice. Maybe. Yes, very good. Yes, that's very nice. And uh, let's see, what about Frank? Uh huh, Frank. I, I, <clears throat> I work in a Spanish area. Okay. All right. Very good. So you teach um, a Spanish. Okay. You belong to the Spanish area. Very nice. Uh, let me see here. What about Adilio? Ya? Logro formular la Adilio? <laughs> Algo parecido. <laughs> I'm, more, I'm more in Spanish area uh, for educación cristiana no sé ah, cómo decirlo okay. you teach religion like faith okay. all right okay very nice thank you all right very good guys excellent very nice okay entonces vamos a irnos ahorita vamos a hacer esto antes de seguir con lo demás vamos a hacer esto en la página 29 so what i want you to do is i want you to read the uh, word and I want you to match uh, with the activities they perform, okay? So for example, you say production, busquela, you say, dice, ah, buy and acquire raw material, blah, blah, blah. So number one is this one for you. Si para ustedes es number six is this one, ponga number six ahí. Tienen que ir leyendo the, the word with the definition or the activities they perform. Ok, una vez terminen eso, esa es en la página 29. Una vez terminen eso, quiero que hagan lo siguiente. Va a poner su departamento, lo mismo que me acaban de decir, uh, the teaching department, Spanish area or English area, y me pone las actividades que usted, que usted realiza, no que realiza su compañero o compañera. La idea es que usted le diga y le cuente, esto hago. Ok. All right, guys, entonces tenemos dos actividades. Primero esta de la página 29 y luego va a poner teaching area, en el caso que esté en el teaching area, perdón, el teaching department, luego el area, si es Spanish or English. All right, and then tell me what you do in your um, area, okay? Okay, guys, we understand? Okay, okay. Excellent, let's go. Hold on, give me a second here.
Y hoy llovió todita la mañana. Recording in progress, yes. <laughs> ya se la puede, Damari. <laughs> you finish? Yes? Yes. All yes. right. Okay, let's go back then, okay? All right, guys, you finished? I finished. Excellent. Estamos right. inspirados. Estábamos bien inspirados. Estaban inspirados. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, let's see here. All right, guys, very good. Number one is production. What is the activities they perform? Okay, maybe the con production. Control and supervise the production. Workforce in inventory. No. Uh, control and supervise the production workforce and inventory. That one, right? Um, Jenny. Yeah. Very good. All right, guys. Very good. What about number two? Research and development. Develop. Design new or improve existing products or processes. Okay, that could be one. Yes. All right. What about purchasing? What about purchasing? What would be the right definition uh, of buy in a car, raw material production, equipment, etc., for the use? of the organization. Excellent, buy and acquire. All right, raw material is materia prima. All right, raw materials, production, equipment for the use of the organization. Very good, what about marketing? Number two. Research. Uh-huh, number two. No, for marketing, no. Research and uh, identify what customers want and need at uh, the right place. Okay, all right, that could be one. Research and identify what customers want and need at the right place. Very good, what about human resources management? Re, re, recruit, select, recruit, and recruit, new employees for the right of job in the company. Excellent. Recruit, select, and train new employees for the right job in the company. Very good. What about accounting and finance? Keep the fine. Fine, the financial, finance, the financial, financial? record of transactions in open monetary inflows and outflows. outflows. Yes, very outflows. good. Okay, yes, keep the financial record transactions involving monetary inflows and outflows. All right, very good. Thank you, guys. Very nice. Okay, let's see. Charlie, a ver, Charlie. Um, you're gonna tell me the department that you work for and then the activities that you do in your department, um, Charlie. Uh, me? Yes, Charlie, please. Of me? Yes, Charlie. I, I work in maintenance area. Uh, I paint the school. I fix pink and one more. Uh, and I fix uh, implica muchas cosas porque <laughs> es de todo. Um, Charlie, you uh, are a handyman. Because you fix everything. Uh, 
A handyman. Okay, yes. Yeah, very good. Nice. All right, Charlie. Very good. All right. Let's see. Laurita. Uh -huh, Hi, Laura. What about your department and the activities that you do in your department? Um, teaching department is a Spanish okay. area. Okay. And I teach language, language in Spanish and social study subject. Ah, very nice. All right. Okay. All right. Very good. Thank you, Laura. Very nice. What about Roxana? Tell us about your department and the activities, Roxana. Uh, I department I department area is a uh, check in the in the test. Okay. Um, I uh, impartir no sé cuál es. You give you give you give language in Spanish. Ah. Uh, okay. hist history in Spanish. Uh, sociales. Social studies. Okay. Ah, oh, nice. All right. Very good. Thank you. Suficiente. <laughs> Solamente. Es a lot. <laughs> Mucho, Roxana. Very good. Pero que nice. Very good. What about um? What about Marisol? <laughs> Um, eh, eh. assistant the the direction oh the principal's office y, y teacher de caligrafía okay no sé cómo sería caligrafía. Um, caligrafía. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Can be penmanship or writing, right? Yeah, I think more writing. We don't really have caligrafía in English. I mean, we don't teach it as a subject in the schools, but yeah. All right. We teach, we teach as a penmanship. Right. Okay. Yeah. No, but I'm talking like in Canada, for example, when I studied in Canada, we didn't have calligraphia classes. <laughs> it's only in El Salvador. All right. <laughs> but yeah. So yeah. Okay. But lines, they call it lines over there. All right. Very good. Thank you. Very good. Um, Michelle, what about um, your department, Michelle? Okay. Uh, I work in elements, the teacher. In okay. art oh. and seed work in Spanish in kindergarten. Oh, that's very nice. Super. That's fun. All right. Thank you, Michelle. Thank you very much. All right, guys. Let's continue here then. Okay. Uh, vámonos otra vez al manual. Y eso es lo que vamos a empezar a ver ahora. All right. Page 30. How to use simple present information questions we have information questions, all right? So for example, we say, what do I do? Where do you work? When do we go to meetings? How do they plan the marketing? What time do you take breakfast, okay? So these are information questions. Se recuerda que la semana pasada estábamos viendo yes, no questions. Cuando decimos en inglés, de hecho, hay dos tipos de preguntas. Yes, no, questions and information questions. También les llamamos WH questions, all right? So, the yes, no questions son simples. Voy a dejar de compartir en lo que explico un poquito. Yes, no questions son simples porque es, la respuesta va a ser yes or no. Yes, I do. No, I don't. Yes, we do. No, we don't. Yes, he does. No, he doesn't. All right, yo le digo, do you live in San Martín? Yes, I do, or no, I don't. Do you, I don't know, do you run every afternoon? Yes, I do, or no, I don't. Okay, ahora, si yo le digo, where do you run? Y usted me dice, yes, I do, no me entendió la pregunta. Porque no estoy preguntando si corre, estoy preguntando dónde corre. Okay, entonces ya no podemos decir ni yes, 
uh, we do, ni no, they don't, porque no tiene sentido, ¿verdad? Entonces, para poder entender estas preguntas, obviamente, hay que saber el significado de los WH question words, ¿ok? Now, a ver, Diana, regáleme, si sabe alguna, si no, no hay problema, regáleme una WH question word, Diana. Si no sabe, no se preocupe. O si no se acuerda. I don't know. Okay, that's okay. That's fine. Uh, let me see what about um, Jasmine. WH question word, Jasmine. Uh, where do you live? Where? Okay. Where? Very good. Okay. Well, uh, that's the WH question word, where, all right? Lorena, give me another question word. What? Excellent, very good. Um, Ede, give me another question word. Which? Excellent, very nice, super. Uh, what about Jenny, another question word? When? When, all right. A ver, ¿quién más me ayuda con alguna si falta alguna? Why? Why, very good, Charlie. Why, okay. Why? Yes. Who? 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 Very good. Who, yes, Chiqui. Who? Yes, Jenny. Who? Me falta una. A ver, Beita. Oh. How? How? Oh, very good. Excellent. How? Okay, very nice. So we have. What, where, when, who, how, which, why. All right, trabajamos con esas siete básicas. De estas se derivan otras, por ejemplo, how much, how long, how many, how far, and all the other ones, all right? But the basic ones are seven, WH question words, all right? What, where, ya la vamos a ver, what, where, when, who, how, why, and uh, I can't remember the which, all right? So we have seven question words, okay? Ahora, se las comparto aquí. Second, ahorita, ahorita. All right, guys, so can you see my presentation? Yes? Yes, me. yes me. Excellent. Okay, so we have who, what, where, how, when, why, y faltó aquí which. Usted póngale aquí which, all right? No problem. So we have seven question words, okay? Yes, Beita. Eh, María acaba de escribir que se, se, fue, se fue la energía eléctrica. Ah, oh, okay. Casa. Mari, okay, okay, that's fine. Thank you. Gracias. All right. Deme un segundito, please. Necesito mandar una copa. Give me one second, guys. All right, sorry. Okay, so when we talk about who, a ver, Jenny, explain who, but not in Spanish. What does who mean? When do I use who? But is, is who is the thing? Or your question for the thing? Mm, who? No. Um. I can't remember. Okay. <laughs> that's okay, Jenny. That's fine. A ver, um, Beita, who? When do we use who? When, when we uh, ask for a person. Excellent, Bea. Yes, when we ask for a person. Who? I say, who is she? You say, ah, she's my teacher. Who is he? Ah, he's my brother. All right, who is that little boy? Ah, he's new, he's a new student. Who is for person? All right, very nice. What about where? 
Um, the Mari, where? How can you explain where? Where? Cuando usamos. And no, 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 Mari, the Mari in English, the Mari. <laughs> When do we when, ah, okay. when the when the use the place? Excellent, the Mari. Yes. When we talk about places, very good, the Mari. Excellent. Very nice. Jasmine, what about when? Excuse me? When? When do we use when? What does it mean? When? When is for when we do uh, time? Excellent, yes, yes. When we talk about time, all right. When we talk about time, not only like the watch, but we talk about the year, the day, the period of the day, all right. When in general, all right. Very good. Let's see, Charlie. When do we use how? When, when we speak about mm, hay cantidad, se me va la palabra en inglés, cantidad. Quantity. Perdón. Quantity. Quantity. Ajá. Uh -huh. Okay. Mm, all right. Okay. I can buy that. Very good. What about... Why, Chiki? When do we use why? When you ask for a reason, a specific reason That's about right. something. About something. Very nice. Thank you. All right. Mari. Hi, Mari. All right. Mari, when do we use what? When, when talk about uh i don't know in english <laughs> <laughs> you're doing okay mari very good when we talk about what what time is it okay so when we talk about something right like time or, mm -hmm. all right very good when we talk about something very good okay guys and then we have which all right um which Let's see here, Frank. When we when do we use which? When do we use which, Frank? Which is a question to um, quantity? I I don't know how do you say that. Mm, quantities not really which we wish um uh, no uh -huh. no wish wish is a uh, 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 for for um a uh, many a uh, many a uh, many answer qual yeah it would be for an option frank for options uh, uh, many options right. no. yes that, very that, good frank thank options. you thank you very much all right guys voy a dejar de compartir aquí un ratito voy a tomar la asistencia y seguimos all right adilio hernández polanco yes, sonia daisy hernández de guardado arely del carmen cortés de peña present gloria dayana álvarez de morales present Roxana Elizabeth Alcántara de Roldán. Present. Carlos Mauricio Cabrera Moreno. Miss. Yes. Ok. Present. Yolanda, thank you. Yolanda Beatriz Angulo de Bielman. Okay. Present. Paola Giselle Guardado Ortega. Ada Carolina Campos Viuda de Ruano. Marisol Chinchilla de Rivera. Present. Edith Lorena Martínez Oval. Present. María José Alfaro de Hernández. Present. Yasmín Yamilet Pacheco de Meléndez. Present. Edgar Edenilson Meléndez Rivera. 
Present. Laura Noemí Rivas Rivas. Present. Katherine Michelle Mejía Hernández. Present. Jenny Marisol Escobar Hernández. Present. Ercilia Damari Quintero Alvarado. Present. Gloria Maribel Mazariego de Morales. Present. And Francisco Antonio Rendero. All right. Present. Thank you, Frank. Very good. Okay, guys, let's continue here. All right. No, Ceci, if you have any questions hasta ahorita, antes de que continúe, do you have any questions? No? Michelle. Yes. Maria Jose. Este, I have a question. Yes, what's Dijo your question? que Wish se utilizaba eh, para cuando se hace con, cuando se va a dar opciones, algo así. Sí, le como entendió. opciones, exacto. Estoy mal. No, así. Por ejemplo, okay. yo le digo, which color do you like? Pink or black? All right. Or which ah, restaurant okay. do you want to go eat to? I don't know. Los cebollines o el arriero. All right. So I give you two options. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Very good. Okay. So let's continue here, guys, please. Um, we have this one. All right. Now. Here we have who, what, where, when, why, how. Nos hace falta which, pero ya lo pusimos. These questions are the key to learning. You can never answer these questions with yes or no. Ojo, esas no son yes, no questions. Yo le digo, where do you live? Y usted me dice, yes, I do. No estamos comprendiendo la pregunta. All right, so you have to give me more information. Por eso le llamamos information questions because I want to know more information about you, okay? Very good. When do we use these questions? These questions are used to gather information, reúning information. Example, what is your name? Si yo le digo, what is your name? Y usted en lugar de decirme, Jasmine Jamilet me dice, yes, I am. Estamos mal. All right, so you say, no, 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 I, I am, or my name is Jasmine Jamilet. Very good. This question is asked at the beginning of a conversation when you're meeting someone new. En el caso, ¿verdad? En el caso de la, de la que acabamos de ver, what is your name? Es lo, lo primero que preguntamos cuando conocemos a alguien. The speaker get their information by asking WH questions or information questions. Son las mismas. So how do you know what WH question to use? Okay, now. Here, guys, este es como el cuadrito, si usted quiere le toma foto, lo dibuja, o si ya lo entiende, no hay ningún problema, o lo quiere recordar nomás. So who, we talk about person or people. What, we talk about thing, idea, event, or action. Where, voy a poner aquí, where we talk about place. When, we talk about time. Ojo, cuando hablamos de tiempo no solo es de horas sino que es de años, de día, de semanas, de momento, or is when in general. Why, como decía Chiqui, is the reason. You, you ask for a specific reason. Y cuando usted contesta, va a contestar because. All right? How, bien decía por ahí, creo que fue, me parece, how lo hacemos para quantity, quality, or the way. La típica pregunta, how are you? All right, it's the calidad, all right? So how are you? I'm fine, how are you? I'm sick, how are you? I'm tired, how are you? I'm great, how are you? I'm sad, all right? So you're talking about how you are, the way that you feel, all right? Luego vemos quantity, como how much, how many, how long, how far, y ya nos metemos como en tipo de cantidades por ahí. Pero la primera definición sería way or quality, right? So that is how. Okay, guys? Tenemos preguntas hasta ahí? Very good, guys. Thank you. Okay. 
Aquí tenemos ejemplos. All right, Jasmine, regálenme los, eh, los ejemplos de, de todo el who, please. No le entendí, me escuchó cortado. Ok, si, si nos lee por favor los ejemplos que están en, este, en esta eh, imagen. Ok. How do you sit next on the class? How is your father? How do you like better Dora or Diego? Jasmine, 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 your... Jasmine, excuse me. It's who, Jasmine, okay? Who? I'm Not sorry. how. No, that's okay, that's okay. Okay. <laughs> who, who do you sit next? To in class, who is your father? Who do you like better, Dora or Diego? Who is your good mo Godmother? Godmother, uh huh. Godmother, who is your best friend? Okay, very good. Okay, so, ahora quiero que notemos algo importante acá. Aquí estamos usando who tanto con el presente simple do como el otro presente simple por ponerlo así con el verbo be. El uso de las WH questions son en cualquier tiempo verbal. Pasado, presente, futuro, presente perfecto, futuro perfecto, como usted quiera. Usted va a preguntar who lo puede usar. Si se fija la estructura es la WH question before the auxiliary or before the to be verb. Who do you see? Who is your father? Who do you like better? All right, so here we have WH question and then the auxiliaries and then the subject and then the rest of the question. All right, let's see. Bea, can you please read this one, please? What? Um, what are you What are you doing for dinner? What did do? What did you do last night? Mm -hmm. What are they doing? What is in your backpack? Okay. Use what when you want. No, you know. <laughs> oh, go ahead, go ahead, Bea. Yes. Okay. okay, we use what. Use what when you want information about a thing. Excellent, very good. All right, then we have when. All right, Marisol, can you read when? When are you going to your homework? Continue, Marisol, please. When, uh, when is your birthday? Mm -hmm. When do we when, when do we have had a class? When do the giant the, giant. the giant play? Yes, the giants play. Use when you want information about the times. So happy. Happens. Excellent. Happens. Very good. Yes. Thank you. All right. Where? All right. Michelle, can you read where, please? Okay. Um, <laughs> uh, where? So you say where? Yes. Yes, Michelle. Yes. Where do you live? Yes. Mm -hmm. Where are you? Where do you go to show? To school? Ah, school. Yes. Well, can I go get pizza? Excellent. Mm, you? No sé cómo se dice. Use. 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 Muy bien, sí. Use, use where when you want information about a place. Excellent, a place. a place. Very good, very good mission, thank you. Yes, very nice, all right. Why? 
Okay, um, Mari, do you want to read one? Okay. Why do you want to be a teacher? Why do you want to learn English? Why is Johnny leaving school early today? Why do I need to go to gym class? Use why when you want to know the reason for something. Excellent, very nice, thank you. Um, Frank, can you read how? Frank, are you there? No? All right, um, Damari, can you read how, please? Uh, how? How are how <laughs> how are you feeling? Mm -hmm. How or e how how oh, how old is your brother? How many dogs do you have? How do you how do I get to Market Street? <laughs> how how was school today? Use how when you want to now the way in which sometime sometime is something? done something is done, is done or when you want to know i sorry i don't see i already <laughs> when you want to know the Quality uh -huh. and quantity. Excellent, Damari. Very nice. Thank you. All right. Let's see. Roxana. Hi, Roxana. Hoy le tocó la pregunta. <laughs> no, Roxy, espéreme. Ahorita vamos a dejar, vamos a, voy a dejar de, de compartir aquí. All right. A ver. Okay. Tenemos preguntas hasta ahorita with the WH questions, the definitions and the meaning, the usage of all of them. Do you have any questions? No questions? No, teacher. Charlie, no, me parece no. que me está diciendo algo. Eh, con todas estas... Eh, ¿Cómo se le llaman a estos? ¿Cómo se llaman? Con todos estos conceptos, eh, se usa la estructura que nos mencionó antes, que primero deben ir estas, luego el, el, el auxiliar o pronombre. Con todas ellas. Con todas. Muy bien. All right. ¿Se recuerda cómo era la estructura de una yes no questions, Charlie? Que era nada más, por ejemplo, uh, do you like pizza? Entonces tenemos, do you like, o do you eat pizza, por ejemplo, do you eat pizza, ¿verdad? Entonces tenemos do, o sea, auxiliar, plus subject, plus verb, plus complement. Entonces es la misma estructura, solo que le antepone bien al inicio de la oración la WH question que usted, con la que usted quiere saber algo, ¿ok? All right, very good, Charlie, thank you. All right, guys. A ver, vamos a hacer lo siguiente. Usted escoja cualquier WH question. Puede ser what, where, when, why, how, como usted quiera. All right. Piense en una, nada más. De las siete, una. Formule la pregunta y la pregunta me la hace a mí. All right. Tienen tres minutos para hacer la pregunta. No salen a recreo si no la tienen. All right. So do that now. Okay. Me van avisando cuando ya todos la van teniendo lista, pero igual en dos, tres minutitos empezamos. Finish. Ok, Jazz, ya vamos, ya vamos. Thank you. Finish. Thank you, María José. Finish. Very good, Maribel. 
15 minutes. Excellent. Thank you. Como vamos a ir por turnos, entonces, si por ejemplo alguien ya hizo la misma pregunta que usted tenía en mente, le tocó cambiarla. <risa> no me vale. Ready. <risa> All right, chiqui, thank you. All right. Excellent. <risa> ah, pues ya, le, ya le pregunto entonces. Nada, Dilio, usted va a ser el último. No mentira, Dilio. <risa> Excellent, Laurita. Very good. All right. Michelle finished. Damari, Jenny, Diana, Roxana. Everybody's finished? Finished. Elena, thank you. All right. Yes. All right. Charlie, are you also finished? Frank finished. Ede finished. Marisol, Beita. Yes, Miss. I finished. Excellent. Finish. Very good. Okay, I think everybody's finished, so that's very nice. A ver, Roxana, como usted quedó pendiente con el otro ejercicio, you are the first one to ask. A ver, Roxana, what is your question? Where do you live? Ah, very good. I live. Where? Yes. Um, I live Carretera Comalapa. Very good, Roxana. Thank okay. you. Good question. Only, only one, Roxana. Vamos para, para que todos... Only one right now, Roxy, okay. okay? All right, very good. Thank you. Let's see. Diana, your question. Uh, what color do you like? <gasps> oh, my goodness. Depende, Diana. Um... I like, I like blue, pero de, depends, <laughs> depends on many things, but I like blue. Very good, Diana, thank you. All right, Charlie, what's your question? Who is your father? Excuse me? Who is your father? Ah, my father is a man that his name is Jorge. <laughs> All right. Yes. Very good. Jenny, what is your question? When did you buy this, your headband? When, when did I buy my headband? Oh, oh my goodness. Yes. I, don't know. I bought it um, two months ago, I think. <laughs> very good. Thank you. Okay. Nice question. Aha, Dilio, your question. Ya ve que no era el último. Thank you. De, creo que mi inter pero se puso negra mi pantalla pero ahí va mi pregunta who how old is your sister how old is my sister yeah my sister uy no sé <laughs> uh, my sister is 47 years old All right, very good. Thank you, Adilio. Good question. Very nice. Laurita, your question. What is your favorite food? Pupusas. <laughs> My favorite food is pupusas. Excellent, Laura. Very nice. Thank you. All right. Let's see. Chiqui, what's your question? I'm sorry. What time do you take a break? <laughs> um, do you want to do you want to know the truth, Chicky? <laughs> um, I take a break for lunch, and I take a break after this class, after like eleven thirty. <laughs> About that, Chicky. <laughs> okay. Right, thank, thank you. Very good, Mari. What's your question? Okay. Um, no sé si es. What is your wedding date? Or when was your wedding? Cualquiera de las dos. 
<laughs> Se puede. Es que no sé, sabías. No. Okay. Was a first, okay. When was your wedding? <laughs> my wedding was on August 24th, 2002. <laughs> Okay, thank yes. you. Thank you. Very good. Thank you. All right, Damari, your question. Okay, Miss, listen to me. How old are you? Oh, no. <laughs> um, bueno, all right. I, <laughs> I am 42. <laughs> I am 42 okay. years old, pero mañana I'm 43, así que me preguntó okay. qué. <laughs> really? Yeah, very okay. good. Yes, yeah. very nice. Maria Jose, what's your question? No estoy segura si es así, pero este, which is, which is your favorite, the movies or music? Music. Samara. No, está bien. Ah, okay. Yeah, okay, music. Okay. Music, very good. Yes, thank you. thank you. Very good. Bea, what's your question? Todas me las quitaron. What is your past time? time? Past time? Ah, yes. Past um, tiempo? Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, I, have, I have many, uh, Bea, but I love um, exercising and I love I love spending time with my children. All right, very good. Thank you, very nice. Let's see, Jasmine, what's your question? Uh, where did your honeymoon? Excuse me? Where, where, what? Where was? <laughs> Your honeymoon. Ah, Antigua, Guatemala. Yeah. <laughs> All right, very good. Yes, very nice. Thank you. Ede, what's your question? Ede, no le de copia a Yasmin. Es que la había formulado. No, tranquila, I'm just kidding. All right. What Ajá. is your favorite season? What is your favorite season? In El Salvador is summer, and in Canada is autumn. All right, very good question. Nice, thank you, Edith Lorena. What's your question? Antes que todo, casi la mayoría ya me las habían quitado. Entonces me ha tocado ir haciendo varias. <laughs> oh no. Bueno, esta no sé si ya me la habían quitado. How many kids do you have? No, no se la habían quitado. I have three children. Okay. Very good. Thank you. Very good. Let's see. Michelle, what's your question? Uh, what is your best friend? My sister. My sister is my best friend. Okay. Very oh. good. Thank you. Very good. Let's see. Uh, Marisol and then Frank. What? What is what is a color case the cellular or cell phone? No sé. It's transparent. <laughs> it's transparent. <laughs> Very okay. good. It's transparent, Marisol. Thank you. And Frank, what's your question? Yo creo que Frank no escucha. No, me dijo que estaba teniendo problemas con el internet. Okay, all right, uh -huh. very good. Thank you, Mari, very good. Okay, guys, very good questions, all right? So the idea is for us to practice a little bit like the question type and everything. So you guys are doing super good, all right? Thank you. Let's see here. Let's go now to, let's go back to the book here, all right? And I want us to work on this. Vamos a trabajar otra vez en su manual. All right, we have this one right here, page 30. Seguimos en la page 30 here. Ahora, aquí tiene su respuesta. Okay? Esas son las respuestas. Ustedes en su grupo tienen que hacer la pregunta. All right? Ahora con WH questions. All right? 
eso vamos a hacer ahorita por tiempo, eh, vamos a hacer esto y luego regresamos y vamos a ver qué, si logramos hacer otra actividad antes de retirarnos, ¿ok? So, page 30, guys, please. All right, let's go. Mari, ¿en qué grupo estaba, Mari? Con Fran. Yo creo que me quedé afuera, mi. El 8 o el 9, no recuerdo. I don't remember. Ah, es que usted estaba con Frank y se salió. No, me sacó la luz. <ríe> sí, es cierto. <ríe> Tiene razón. Pero fíjense que Frank lo moví al 7 porque usted ya no estuvo por la luz. Pero a Frank no. <ríe> la voy a mandar. A... Con Bea. Bye. Con Bea, permítame que no encuentro a Beita yo aquí. La hora, ay, pero Bea ya está en un grupo de tres. <ríe> sorry. Um, oh, sorry, I'm sorry. Uh, what about Laura? Marisa. No, sí, Laura, Laura, Laura está con Bea. <ríe> A ver, la sala 4, sí, sí, Eddie Lorena. Ah, está bien, está bien. Sí. Excelente. Thank you. You're Thank welcome. You. You're welcome.
Okay, how do you, how do you make a report? Huh? You finished, Miss. You finished everything? Yes. All right, we're going back then. <laughs> <coughs> okay. <laughs> All right, guys, let's see. Um, what about Mari? Um, we have question number one. What is the question that you came up with, Mari? Okay, the question is, when do you write the reports? I have to write a report about the production every Friday. Excellent. When do you write a report or when do you have to write a report? Very good, thank you. What about number two? Um, Jasmine's group, what is your question? The first question. For number two. Ah, number two. Where do you work? Yes, where do you work? I work in the blue building. Very nice. All right, very good. What about the Mari? Can you work on number three? Number three. What time do you start your work? What time do you start? At work. <laughs> what time do you start work or what time do you start working? I, Maria and I start working at 10. Okay, very good, sounds fair. Uh, let me see here, Jenny, what about number four? What they do at work? Say it again, Jenny. What they do at work? El auxiliar, ¿cuál sería? Do. Okay. Repítala entonces. What do they do at work? Ah, what do they do at work? Um, ¿Crees que el pronombre está bien, Jenny, o podríamos poner otro? Porque la respuesta dice we. We. Um, we. Mm -hmm. And su pregunta decía, what do they do at work? All right, pero la respuesta yeah. dice, we design. Uh, but is... Uh, you? Ah, that's better, yes. What do you do at work? We design other and others create the new product. That's better. All right, nice. All right, okay. Eddie. Yes. You mean? Es que yo puse. Bueno, no, no. O sea, tengo duda. Sí, dígame. Who did Who decide the products? No es correcto. Mm, pero es como que esté contestando en la misma pregunta. Who designs the product? We design, and others create the new product. Esto podría estar bien. All right, that's fine. But I think it's a little bit better because of the type of questions we're making right now. Like, what do you do at work? It sounds fair, all right? So we decide and others create the new product. But it's okay to the money, okay? All right, what about number five, guys? Who wants to do number five? Can be how do they make a report? No. No. Uh, why they why have the meeting? Have... Why? They... Why they have the meeting? Why do, why do they? Why, why do, do they, they have... have a meeting? Excellent. Why yes. They... Why do they have a meeting? They have a meeting because we have to talk about the inflows and outflows. Very good. All right. Come on. Where, where... Why? Yes, why, Bea? Porque ahí en la respuesta dice because. Ok, no necesariamente tiene que decir because al inicio. No. Not necessarily. Why, qué? Why, the, why do they why have a meeting? Do they? Why do they have a meeting? Yes. Mm -hmm. Y puedo decir en el número uno. 
What do you what do you have to do? Sí, what do you have to do? Says I have to write a report about the production every Friday, sure. And number three, what time do you start to work? Also, yes. Start, start. Yes. It's okay, Bea. Okay. All right, very good. Okay. Vamos a terminar eh, con esta práctica ahorita. Acá en number six says, create questions with the WH words provided below. Then ask the questions to a partner. Ahorita tenemos que cuatro minutos. Tenemos the WH question, what, when, where, why, and who. Mañana no sabemos con quién vamos a estar trabajando. Entonces no piense precisamente en alguien. Pero necesito que avance haciendo estas preguntas, ¿ok? Cuando entremos mañana a clase y cuando estemos la mayoría, los voy a mandar al, a los grupos y vamos a empezar con estas preguntas. Entonces, trabaje ahorita con haciendo una pregunta using what, using when, where, why, and who. Hasta donde avance, ¿ok? Ok. All right, guys. Edith Lorena, hoy me acompaña usted un ratitito, oye. Ok, Miss. Thank you, Edith. Y mañana se queda María José. Thank you. All right. Okay. Y no me escuchó. Acabo de recibir un, por, un mensaje. Ahí se Zoom nos sacó. Entonces no escuchamos nada. Ah, Jazz. Ok, Jazz, no se preocupe. A ver, estamos ahorita casi terminando, Jazz. Están haciendo este ejercicio de abajo. Tienen que elaborar una pregunta por cada WH question pensando que mañana vamos a iniciar con esto. No sabemos con quién vamos a trabajar mañana, pero usted realiza la pregunta. ¿Ok? Using what, when, where, why, and who. All right, Jazz, tenemos un minutito y paso. Una de cada uno. Excuse me. Una pregunta de cada una de ellas. Yes, una por una por cada una. Yes, yes. Uh -huh. Ok, es que se, se oye cortado, pero creo que la señora ya tiene su pregunta yo bien. Ah, ok, Jasmine, that's ok. Igual, ahorita ya voy a tomar la asistencia, pero les queda como para poderlo hacer. Y si no lo terminan ahorita, mañana igual les doy tiempo al inicio de la clase. All right. All right, guys, voy a dejar de compartir. Teacher, si quiero decir, ¿cuándo es tu cumpleaños? When is your birthday? When is your birthday? Pero ahí no, no lleva el tú. No, en ese ¿Cómo? tipo de pregunta no, pero se puede. Es, es, siempre cae en simple, presente. Pero siempre es when. Sí, y siempre es when, exacto. Lo que pasa es que es presente when. simple con el verbo be. Uh -huh. Where, where. Where. 
All right, guys, empiezo a tomar asistencia. Yo sé que están concentraditos, pero mañana continuamos. All right. Adilio Hernández Polanco. Present, Miss. Sonia Daisy Hernández yeah. de Guardado. Arely del Carmen Cortés de Peña. Present. Gloria Dayana Álvarez de Morales. Present. Roxana Elizabeth Alcántara de Roldán. Present. Carlos Mauricio Cabrera Moreno. Present, Miss. Yolanda Beatriz Angulo de Bielma. Present. Paola Giselle Guardado de Orte ah, Ortega, perdón. Ada Carolina Campos, viuda de Ruano. Marisol Chinchilla de Rivera. Present. Edith Lorena Martínez de Sandoval. Present. María José Alfaro de Hernández. Present. Yasmín Pacheco de Meléndez. Edgar Edenilson Meléndez Rivera. Present. Thank you. Laura Noemí Rivas Rivas. Present. Katherine Michelle Mejía Hernández. Present. Jenny Marisol Escobar Hernández. Present. Elcilia Damari Quinteros Alvarado. Present. Gloria Maribel Mazariego de Morales. Present. Al Francisco Antonio Renderos. All right, guys. Entonces, eh, nos vamos despidiendo. Por favor, avancen con la tarea 11. All right. Y los que todavía, no sé si todavía me deben examen de medio curso, necesito que lo terminen hoy. All right. Very good. Los veo mañana. Solo me acompaña Edith Lorena. Un ratito. All right, guys. Thank you so much. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. 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 Good night. Good night, everyone. Thank you. Bye. Oh, hi, Lorena. How are you? How are you, Lorena? I'm fine, Miss, and you? I'm great, thank you. Very good. A ver, Edith, um, la idea es, eh, si usted tiene alguna duda de lo que se ha visto hasta ahorita o algo que usted necesita que le refuerce o le recuerde, con mucho gusto. En la clase de hoy sí sentí un poquito más de dificultad que las anteriores. Um, porque, digamos, esa parte de donde nos tocó crear las questions basadas en las answers, eh, me costó bastante entender eh, cuál, cuál WH question se aplica mejor para esas respuestas. Ok. Eh, okay. Uh -huh. No sé si pudiera como reforzarme un poquito. Eh, ¿Cuándo se usa cada una de las WH sí, questions? Claro que sí, sí, con mucho gusto. A ver, eh, podemos empezar con la de where. Where siempre, cuando usted vea que mencionen lugar, siempre va a referirse a where, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, si yo le digo, si mi respuesta fuera, eh, yo trabajo en inglés corporativo. All right? Inglés corporativo es un lugar. ¿Verdad? Entonces usted dice, ah, ok, es where entonces. De, una, de alguna forma tengo que tener where en mi pregunta. Si yo le digo, ah, eh, ella vive en Los Ángeles. Entonces, Los Ángeles es una ciudad, entonces es un lugar. Nos volvemos a referir a where, ¿verdad? Entonces, siempre que usted vea o identifique un lugar, ya sea chiquito o grande, desde, desde que usted diga el cuarto, ahí está en el cuarto, es where. ¿Verdad? Está en la sala, está en el patio. No importa si es un país o es un lugar, un dormitorio de mi casa, ¿verdad? Entonces siempre va a ser where. Cuando hablamos de when, es tiempo. Cuando hablamos de tiempo, no solo me, me, um, me concentro en hora específica, Edith, sino que en tiempo en general. Yo le digo, um, me gradué en 1900, ya no me acuerdo. <risa> All right, entonces dice, ah, when, estamos hablando de tiempo. Le pregunto, o yo le digo, mi clase de inglés es a las 8 de la noche, when. 
¿verdad? Porque llevamos un tiempo ahí, ¿verdad? O oh, les digo, eh, la pandemia fue el 2020, when, ¿verdad? Entonces, siempre que usted vea un día, un mes, un año, una fecha, un momento del día, Edith, eh, o una hora específica, siempre nos vamos a referir a la WH question when. Ok. Miss, o, o, other question. Eh, las WH question siempre deben llevar un auxiliar o, o el verbo be. Siempre. Siempre. Independientemente. All right. Lo que Porque pasa es que... Ajá. Nosotros en el, en el grupo de en la pregunta number four, eh, bueno, la respuesta es we decide and others create the new product. Uh -huh. Nosotros hicimos la, la pregunta, who designs the products? Pero ahí no veo ni un auxiliar ni tampoco veo el verbo be. Ok, y es una muy buena pregunta, eh, Edith. Cuando hablamos o usamos el, la WH question who, como no sabemos, entonces, ¿quién realizó tal actividad? Si fue plural o fue singular, omitimos el auxiliar. Solo ocupamos el verbo en singular. Entonces decimos, who, por ejemplo, le puedo decir, who lives, quién vive en la casa, who lives in the house. Con el who es bien, es, es bien especial, bien particular, porque no siempre y no en todas las preguntas voy a necesitar un auxiliar. Si yo le pregunto, ¿con ¿Quién? quién vive o con quién trabaja? Sí, who do you, who do you live with o who do you work with. Pero en el caso de quién lo hizo, ahí no necesito un auxiliar. Eh, y por eso que el verbo debe de ir con una S al final, así sí, como exacto. nos ha enseñado en el exacto. present. Sí, porque se vuelve singular. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Bye. Verbo B. Sí. Que me desubiqué un poquito, que como ayer tampoco no me pude conectar a la sí, clase, entonces sí, sentí, sí, sí. Sí, sentí sí. un poquito de desfase, pero ahí vamos, poquito a poquito vamos aprendiendo. Así es, Edith, y cualquier cosa aquí estamos, ¿verdad? Acuérdese que como le decía igual, las WH questions las podemos usar en cualquier tiempo verbal, ¿verdad? Yo le puedo decir con quién fue, eh, dónde trabajó a dónde vivía, dónde vivirá, no importa, ¿verdad? Las WH questions se pueden ocupar en cualquier tiempo verbal, igual con el verbo to be, ¿verdad? Is, are, en el caso que lo amerite la pregunta. Pero si lo usáramos en el pasado, el verbo lo tendríamos que poner en pasado. Eh, el auxiliar. Ah, el auxiliar. El auxiliar sería did. Ah. Uh -huh. Y si fuese en el futuro, en vez de ejemplo, el... sería will. Exacto. En vez del do o el does, va a ser did, si fuese pasado. Okay. Uh -huh. Ah, pues mis, esas eran mis únicas, mis únicas dudas. Excelente. Very good, Edith. Ahí estamos. Oye, qué bueno que, que estamos. Thank you, Miss. Very good. Ya sabe. God blessing you. God bless you too. Bye. Good night. Good bye. night. Good night to you too. Bye-bye. Right. Bye now.